ready good morning dear students welcome to online class of dhubure alifuddin fadil madrasa i am mohammad shofiul alam babu lecturer in english today i will take of your class of alim first year my introducing class uh, in this covid 19 situation uh, i am taking this class i think all of you are well by the grace of almighty i was sick all of your prayer has healed me and today i will discuss with you about a lesson from your first paper textbook nelson mandela from apartheid to apartheid fighter to president all of you know nelson mandela was a prominent figure in the history of racism he all through his life he tried to remove the apartheid residents to dial firstly i'll give you some information about nelson mandela this information will give you a lot of encourage to appear your, your uh, next exam or competitive exam or any other kind of situation nelson mandela's i'll give some information about him nelson mandela's full name from google i have found that his you know nelson mandela his full name actually nelson rohilala mandela he was born july 18 1918 and died 5 december 2013 you have to remember it he died at the age of 95 in those days africa was divided into many clan clan means gotro his clan name was madiba his people adoring him called madiba his full name was his full name was nelson rohilala mandela and his clan name was madiba he was engaged in a political party his party's name was anc in details african national congress whenever you uh, read any passages or any information you have to know the full passages and you have to know the full if you know the full passage and if you know full about him truly it will help you in your next preparation and the in the many competitive exam that's why dear students i would like to tell you to remember this information nelson mandela's political party was african national congress and nelson mandela was given nobel peace prize 19 in 1993 in 1993 and then he became he became in 1994 first black president i'll give you another information nelson mandela was inspired by the father of the indian nation mahatma gandhi mahatma gandhi he was inspired by mahatma gandhi and nelson mandela he has written a book the book the name of the book was a long walk to freedom a long walk to freedom 
His book name was A Long Walk to Freedom. And <coughs> all of you know Nelson Mandela was born 18 July. In Africa, 18 July is observed as Nelson Mandela Day. You have to remember this information. In 18 July, July 18 is observed Mandela Day. You have to remember this. And another information, Nelson Mandela uh, was prisoned nearly three decades. That means uh, 27 years. He was, he was 27 years imprisoned. 27 years imprisoned. Imprisoned, he was imprisoned 27 years and he was uh, he was uh, uh, imprisoned uh, in, near, uh, in an island that is Robben Island. You have to remember this information. He was imprisoned in Robben Island. Robben. Robben Island. This information is not in your textbook. I have collected this from Google. <coughs> in that situation, and Nelson Mandela was buried. Nelson Mandela was uh, uh, buried. Uh, uh, there was a clan in that time. The name of the clan was Julu. Uh, this Julu clan was in the favor of racism. They did not want to remove racism. But, and you have to remember another uh, similar name in this context. Nelson Mandela was buried in Kulu Island. I have in collected this information and next I will go through the text. I will go through the text here, the text. Uh, in the text, first, uh, you, you, first you will find Reuters. Reuters, what you have, I know, uh, you should know this. Reuters, what is Reuters? Reuters, Reuters is a news agency. Reuters is a news agency uh, that was established in 1851. Reuters, Reuters, R-E-U-T-E-R-S, -E -E Reuters was a London-based news agency. Uh, Reuters was a London-based news agency and the founder of this news agency was Thomson Reuters. Thomson Reuters. Uh, Thomson Reuters, Thomson Reuters, Thomson Reuters, and it was a London-based news agency. Next, I will read through the passages. Uh, it is not possible uh, to co uh, complete the passages in a class. I will take a class, another class in this context. Here you will find the report was done in 15 December 2013. 15 December 2013. If you search Google, you will find the report. Here report Johannesburg. You know, uh, a, a city of uh, South Africa capital. Uh, I will go through the passes. Nelson Mandela. Nelson Mandela guided. Guided means, you know, guide means note, guide, this type of. Here guide means lead. Nelson Mandela guided South Africa from the shackles of apartheid to a multiracial democracy. As an icon of peace and reconciliation, who came to embody the struggle for justice around the world. That means, here's a big line, I will uh, make you easy. Nelson Mandela guided. Guide means guide means pori chali to kora. Guide means pori chali. Nelson Mandela guide kore chilo, pori chali to kore chilo South Africa from the shackles. You should underline this word shackles. Shackles means bondhon. Shackles means bondhon. The synonym of the word chain, chain or restriction. Antonym of the word of freedom. Shackles, shackles. Of apartheid. Apartheid, you know, apartheid means borno boishommo, racism. Racism. That means the division between black and white. In that time, in that time, black 
was not allowed to take part in the election of Africa. That was the situation. If you imagine it, the privilege were given only to the white people, that means racism. Nelson Mandela was always against this racism and he wanted to establish peace and equality in the African nation. He was a model. He is not only in Africa but also all over the world. That's why Nelson Mandela is notable in the history of this region. Our lesson actually was people or institution making history. That means the people who have contributed in to establish equal rights to the mankind of the world. In that sense, Nelson Mandela was a very prominent figure and he was a selfless and he was a selfless person for his people. Next, I go through the text again. Nelson Mandela guided South Africa from the shackles of apartheid to a multiracial. Multi means bohu. Racial means jati. Bohu jati. Democracy. Democracy, you know, democracy, gonotantro, where people have right to vote and to elect their uh, choiceable people. As an icon of peach, that means Nelson Mandela was icon, symbol, or emblem of peach, pratik, and reconciliation. Reconciliation that means mimang shakora. That means he wanted to establish peace among the African people. That's why he is a moderator, and he is a media who wanted to reconciliation who came to embody embody that means he materialized the he materialized his dream the struggle for justice that means equality justice which are equality around the world in prison for nearly three decades for his activities Actually, he wanted to remove racism. That's why that time's government was sentenced him to imprisonment for nearly three decades, you know, 27 years, for his fight against white minority rule. White minority that time, white was the dominator. White dominate the total African people. That's why he wanted to establish peace. Mandela never lost his resolve. Mandela never lost his resolve. Resolve means diropotingota. Tar oikanti kota, icha. He never lost his resolve to fight for his people's emancipation. You should underline this word and you have to know this word emancipation. Emancipation means mukti. He Mandela never lost his resolve to fight for his people's emancipation. He was determined. He was determined to bring down apartheid while avoiding a civil war. Nancel, Mandela wanted to establish peace, but not a bloody way. He wanted to establish, he wanted, he wanted a, uh, he wanted to actually, with the arrangement of his black people, he did not want to war, he fight, he wanted to his people education, he wanted to people develop. In this way, he awakened the people and while avoiding civil war, that means sometimes we see some war in the world. His prestige, his prestige, that and his prest and his prestige and charisma helped him. His prestige and charisma helped him win the support of the world. Tar diro potigota, tar shomman, ebong tar adhatik shokti ba oikanti kicha helped him win the support of the world. So, dear students, how do you find 
from the lesson Nelson Mandela was a prominent figure in the history of apartheid he wanted to remove the racism that's why he fought thoroughly here years he became i will remember you he became the first black president in 1994 and he was born july 18 1908 uh, you know that july 18 is observed nelson mandela day in africa his political party's name was african national congress uh, he was imprisoned nearly 27 years his clan name was madiba he was inspired by mahatma gandhi and he died 5 december 2013 you have to remember this and next page i will go through our uh, one stanza also i hate race discrimination most intensely discrimination you know boishommo difference intensely tibro bhabe and all is manifestation that means expression I hate race discrimination most intensely and all its manifestation. I have fought it all during my life. I will fight it now and will do so until the end of my days. Mandela said in his acceptance speech of becoming South Africa's first black president in 1994. When he, when he became the first president in 1994, Nelson Mandela, Nelson Mandela, said that i hate red race discrimination i hate race discrimination most intensely and all is you, you should underline discrimination that means boy shammo intensely tibro bhabe manifestation prakash and tini bolechen i hate race discrimination most intensely and all its manifestation i have fought it all during my life I will fight it now and will do so until the end of my day. That means he, when he will alive, he always is against of racism. We also hate racism. Dear students, in my next class, I will discuss about Nelson Mandela's next part. Thank you for viewing my class. Thank you very much.